YouTube, what is up guys? I'm actually here at work. I just got to work right now. It's about 8.40 right now. And I'm supposed to get here by 8 because there's some things I gotta work on. So I'm gonna go ahead, rush upstairs, and I'll talk to you guys on my lunch break. But there's someone I do want to introduce you to. So let me go ahead and go to office and I'll talk to you guys on my lunch break. What is up, YouTube? I'm not sure if you guys could see me right now. It is extremely bright, by the way. I'm on my lunch break right now. There's someone that I'm going to meet right now on my lunch break. He's actually someone that I've been planning to. Oh shoot! Okay, that was that was really close. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and meet with someone right now. He's someone that I've, we've actually been trying to meet for a while, but we weren't able to due to our schedule. But we're gonna go ahead and meet and get some like boba and iced teas real quick. So let's go ahead and get a road. And let's go there. Funny how the story goes, little hope of bigger dreams. Uh, they try to bring a sucker down, singing louder than the crowd. Uh, Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, okay, okay. That's okay. But Especially you just have to make. No. Oh, that's cool. And right. pretty yeah. much, yeah, put the title here and the description and oh, the title on top of will the go on top of yeah, it. Yeah, like yeah. A motor. I see what you mean. Um, that, and that will be hard, but that looks clean and people will be like, oh, shoot. Yeah, you put in extra detail because this is easy. This looks like it's. Is this bootstrap? Yes, it is. <laughs> okay. Because I made this two months in. Yeah, that's okay. I will go right. materialize. Okay, that's fine. It's okay to use bootstrap. They don't. A lot of companies use bootstrap yeah. materializing. Like, it's okay. It's stupid to write it straight from HTML because it's just faster. And then, um, you, re you rarely, you have to be able to manipulate the DOM, but it's okay to use these things. Sounds good. Man. Good? Yeah. Is it okay for you to say something real quick on YouTube? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> here at Matthew right now, we talked. I wasn't able to really film it. Security was actually looking at me earlier. We met up. I gave you some advice on your portfolio. Pretty much, what were we talking about? You're asking pretty much about like, you should go to bootcamp. What did I say? Should you go to bootcamp? Because I mean, at this age, it's pretty much on you. And boot camps, yeah, it might be the easy way in. But as long as you dedicate and focus on it, <laughs> I've got to go to <laughs> Some pretty solid tips on my portfolio as well. <laughs> yeah, so pretty much what I told him, he doesn't need to go to boot camp. You can if you don't get a job in six months, maybe. But I think you're skilled enough. He's 21. He's turning 22. He's just impatient. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna do transition now. I gotta go. I actually have to go to work. Absolutely. Okay, you want to do transition now? I, like what? I'll hit the blend. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. <laughs> yeah, oh. dude. All right, guys, so it's the end of the day. I'm actually supposed to head out right now, but I figured I'd go ahead and talk to you about my meeting with Matthew today. It was pretty fun, man. It was exciting. Well, Matthew is someone who moved there from out of the country, right? He works for Target right now, just like Emmanuel, but he actually knows quite a bit of code. But I was kind of shocked that he was planning on going to a boot camp in the first place. The reason I was shocked is because with the skill that he had and the projects he built, he doesn't need to go to a boot camp. And I told him, dude, like, look at the code you know. You don't need to go to boot camp. And I asked him, why are you going? I mean, why do you want to be $12,000 in debt to go to a boot camp when you, when you already know the code that you learned? But I was still surprised. And he said, like, he just wants to go for the networking. And I told him, dude, why would you spend $12,000 for networking instead of going to a boot camp? Just go to meetups all around Orange County, Los Angeles, all over this area, and you can network that way. He's telling me how he just he like he wants a job now, and I told him, dude, you're 20, you're 21, you're turning 22 in a couple days. It makes no sense for you to go to boot camp and rush it when you already know as much code as you know. And he was in a rush. And I think this is the one thing that a lot of people here on this channel need to understand. Don't rush trying to get into the industry. Boot camp can sound so exciting and so amazing, but spending twelve thousand dollars to Learn amount of just X amount of code in three months. To me personally, knowing what I know now, getting the jobs that I've gotten thus far, for me, bootcamp makes no sense at all. You can learn so much of this code on your own. Now, it does depend on what you're learning at the bootcamp, what is you're trying to do. And so I, I told him, like, bro, like, don't rush it. You're 22. 
You don't have to rush all these things. You don't have to get a job right away. You're 22, just stay where you're at, be patient, work hard, and apply. And I did ask him, bro, how much do you apply? And he says he doesn't apply to as many jobs as he should. <laughs> so I tell him, bro, you need to make sure that you apply to as many jobs as you possibly can every single day. And he, and he told me too, like I get discouraged because I see these offer, like these jobs on, on, on let's say Indeed.com or Craigslist and it says you need five years of experience. And I tell him, dude, my company right now is asking for X amount of experience, right? And I barely had any of that yet, I still got the job. Why? Because I just applied. You never know exactly what it is they're looking for. So I tell him, whether well, this is five years or not, you need to apply. Just do it every single day. You have nothing to lose. And honestly, I would be surprised if he didn't get a job within the next six months. But I did give him advice on how to do his portfolio, how to make it better. I do have some experience with UI UX and I know what looks good. And I I guess you could say I do have a creative mind. Like for example, my, my B-Rail, <laughs> right? I'm pretty creative and I gave him some advice in regards to that too. But you don't need to go to bootcamp. I, I should have suggested that he could have just done the tech degree program. Mainly why the tech degree program, what makes it valuable is because of their projects that they give you, $200 a month, that's only what, $1,200, 200 times 12, or $2,400 a year, compared to $12,000 in three months. The tech degree is so much more worth it, and you get tutored, and you get guidance from their moderators, their teachers at Treehouse. Uh, but again, yeah, anyway, I mean, you could learn any way you want, but I just don't think bootcamp is worth it anymore, especially in regards to the skill he had. If you wanna do bootcamp, I'm not judging. Everyone learns their own way, but yeah, those are my thoughts. Anyway, hope you guys like this video. Like this video if you can. Leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this too, if you can as well. Thank you guys for watching. This is Krishan. This is Life Web Developer. And I'm out. Peace.